welcome to my channel and in this video I'm going to show you how you can authenticate your proxies in Selenium. Let's get started. So first of all you need to install, well there are actually multiple ways to do this. One way is to add an extension or plugin in Selenium where it authenticates you to your um, proxy. The second way is using uh, another program where it basically fills your, the username and the password but those are a little bit complicated and the easiest one by far is just a uh, Python package that does it automatically. So what you need to do is install a little uh, package called um, pip selenium wire. So you do that. I've already installed it so I won't do it again. Once you've installed this, you go to your editor and you type from selenium wire selenium wire import web driver it's basically the same thing as the selenium web driver you just have more options where you can use uh, your authentication that's it and let's declare our driver so web driver chrome if you want to know how to install selenium i'll link a video on top so my chrome binary is in tmp and um, driver that quits that's how you let's declare a proxy so options equals a dict with proxy another dict and here basically you have http and you'll have https well you'll also have one where you don't have a proxy so it's going to be no proxy where you write localhost it basically redirects to the local host if you don't have a proxy. So here the format will be HTTP, uh, then your username, your pass, your IP, and your port. That's going to be uh, the format. So naturally it's going to be the same here, but with HTTPS. Now I'm going to censor mine, so now that you know that. Okay, let me write mine. I'm actually only going to use the IP and port to show you that I'm not authenticated. So, IP and port. Uh, let me remember. Go, let's write the same here. All right. Okay, let's do a request. So, on let's check what our IP is so what is my IP address.com and let's also put a little timer here well asleep so that we can see uh, see the page a little bit eight import time there you go and let's pass it to Chrome so Basically, the only difference is here you type selenium wire options, it's options here, and you add options. Now, normally I'm not authenticated, so it's going to ask me for my username and password. There you go, I'm not authenticated. Okay, let's quit this. And now I'm going to add my username and password. There you go. Okay, and now it will work. As you can see, I'm connected. I didn't need to authenticate. So there you go, guys. Thank you for watching. If you liked this video, please leave a like and comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe for more content like this. See you. Bye.